Rachel, and I have stress dreams about middle school. Da -na -na, da -na -na -na. This October, I am watching 31 classic horror movies I have never seen before. Movie number 12, Carrie. We open in a high school gym class. Carrie's classmates tell her to eat shit. In the locker room, Carrie takes a shower. She gets her period and begs her classmates to help her. Carrie never learned what a period is. They all laugh and throw tampons at her. Two girls, Chris and Sue, are particularly mean. The gym teacher, Miss Collins, literally slaps Carrie out of it. A light bulb explodes. The principal keeps calling her Cassie. She flips his ashtray with her mind. A kid chants creepy Carrie at her and she glares him off his bike. Carrie's mom, Margaret, goes to see Sue's mother. She's religious as hell. Heck? Whatever. Margaret tells Carrie that periods are a punishment from God for sinful thoughts. She hates sex. Margaret drags Carrie into a punishment closet and makes her pray for forgiveness. Meanwhile, Miss Collins gives all the girls detention for bullying Carrie. Chris talks back and Miss Collins punches her in the face. Chris is not allowed to go to prom. Carrie reads about telekinesis. Sue is feeling guilty, so she asks her boyfriend Tommy to ask Carrie to prom. Chris and her boyfriend John Travolta seem to hate each other but start to scheme together anyway. Tommy asks Carrie to prom. She thinks it's a trick, but ultimately she agrees to go with him. Chris and John Travolta sneak onto a farm to kill some pigs. Carrie tells her mother she's going to prom. Margaret is not happy. Carrie uses her telekinesis and Margaret calls her a witch. Chris and John Travolta set up their prank in the auditorium. Tommy and Carrie are the talk of the town. There's a tuxedo montage. Margaret cries and tells Carrie that everyone's just gonna laugh at her. Tommy and Carrie finally go to prom. Everyone's really nice to her. Tommy and Carrie dance and kiss. The camera goes like this around them. I'm dizzy now. Chris and John Travolta rig the voting so Tommy and Carrie win prom king and queen. Carrie is so happy. Sue notices that something is off. She tries to stop it, but Miss Collins misunderstands, thinks she's trying to do something, and kicks her out of the prom. Then, <sighs> pig's blood. Carrie hallucinates that everyone is laughing at her, including Miss Collins. Then, the lights go red. The doors shut. Water everywhere. There's a split screen. Screaming blood, gore, fire, electricity, fire, burning red. It's bad. Chris and John Travolta try to hit Carrie with a car and she blows their car up. Carrie goes home and takes a bath. Margaret gives a horrible, upsetting monologue. This was hard to watch, so I didn't. She attacks Carrie. Carrie is telekinetic, Margaret. Get it together. Sue and her mother are the only survivors. I'm serious, only survivors. She has chronic nightmares about Carrie's bloody hand. I think I have to rate this movie two out of five stars. The movie is called Carrie and she is certainly the main character. High schoolers are much scarier than telekinesis. See you next time for movie number 13. A scary number.